Good morning and welcome. This is my 1973 Series 3 lightweight air portable Land Rover and it's up for sale on eBay very shortly. Just thought I'd do a little walk around video. This vehicle was laid up for many, many years. I bought it from a friend that passed away. I've extens extensively put parts on it and got it back to the way it should when it left the army. All new brakes, complete, drums, bearings, you name it, it's had it, water pump, batteries, all the Gucci parts, the military bits that were missing have gone back on. All the original radio gear is back in the vehicle. I've fitted a brand new correct rear cross member, which is the military spec, new exhaust. All the correct Pioneer kit on the back. Its original regiment was the Remi, so I've put it back to the Remi TRF on the back. Comes with a correct radio table, two operator's chairs, a DMU, a Klansman, and a Klansman man pack on it, the correct paratroop recce frame. All the other little bits and bobs that go with it. She's a good solid vehicle, drives perfectly. I've put a couple of thousand mile on it with no issues. The only thing I have changed is the steering wheel. I do have the original one to go with it. It all is as is inside the vehicle, correct seat backs, rifle rack, everything is as it should be. The only addition is I've changed the window tops to the slash cut variety so they don't rot again because these are aluminium. Apart from that, she is as she is. She's 24 volt. She's got a very rare personal radio adapter. Comes with the radio as well and the antennas on the sides. Everything is as it should. The tires aren't new, but they're good. I fitted a brand new hinge panel on the other side. It was a little bit rotten, so I put a brand new one in. The rear cross member, as I've mentioned. The canvas is original. It's not in perfect condition, but it's more than adequate. It does what it should. Added some mud flaps, because it's not a Land Rover without mud flaps. My personal opinion. Uh, original toolbox on the side with its original jack inside as well. Just an all round good, original, lightweight Land Rover. It will also be sold with a matching Sankey trailer. So if you guys are interested, you can either contact me direct at Mad Ford Engineering, just Google me and you'll find my phone number. Or alternatively, you can send me an email at madfordengineering at yahoo.com. Thank you. Bye-bye.